man. He is a dominant football player, some dominant level of, of reps from Sean Ryan from UCLA. You know, I'm a competitive guy and I don't like losing, so um, whatever it takes to go out there and win the game. Incredibly powerful. Probably the best core strength, I think, in this class and the best flexibility in this class. I mean, he had the best tape I probably have seen against Kayvon Thibodeau. I mean, he just stonewalled when they played Oregon this year. Your combine, vertical, is 33 and a half higher than some wide receivers. That's right. Southern California kid who Play tackle UCLA had a great battle with Kayvon Thibodeau in that Oregon game. I think he's going to move inside and be a guard as well. Hi, I'm Sean Ryan. I went to UCLA and I played left tackle. Sean Ryan, six foot five, 320 pound lineman from UCLA, and this guy has stepped foot on Westwood as a true freshman and has been a three year starter. Um, first, uh, first game out there, what was that like for you? Uh, it was good, you know, real loud. I haven't experienced that too much in a high school game. Sean Ryan has been special. This guy had 703 pass blocking opportunities over the last two years. He only allowed one sack. I mean, that is as good as a production as you could ask for. Turn on the film against him, against Kayvon Thibodeau, a guy who's going to be a top 10 pick for all that matters. Sean Ryan was holding his own against arguably the best guy in the country at that. I told myself that I'm not going to let him beat me once. And that's my job as the old lineman is to keep the quarterback upright, keep him comfortable, and make holes for the running back so that we can go and win games. You talk a lot about the experience of being a three-year starter and the, the number of snaps that he had. But it's also the quality of those snaps in terms of preparation for the next level. When you have a quarterback, a quick passer, quick release, you know, that is a different set of plays and that is a different set of experiences than when you have a guy like Dorian Thompson Robinson back there. So not only did he have the 703 snaps, look at the types of snaps. Not all experiences are created equal where some of these plays were just so frenetic in UCLA's offense in terms of the breakdown of plays and the fact that he was able to maintain gap integrity, situational awareness, not get penalized, and be able to have the endurance to enable these plays to stay extended and provide UCLA with long range and long yardage opportunities is very, very significant. You know, me feeling like I could keep him upright and keep him comfortable in, in the pocket, allowed him to, you know, go through his reads and be, um, you know, a very good quarterback, so. And then his game is all about leverage, hands, balance, center of gravity. He's a guy that enjoys the contact. You're not always going to out push the other guy, especially when you're coming into the league. You're not always going to out intimidate, out reflex the guy. Invariably, there's going to be contact there. And the fact that Ryan is like an NBA player who just seeks out the contact when he goes down the lane, his natural instinct is to create leverage in that contact. You know, I think that's also what has led to my um, success as an offensive lineman. It's just my ability to adapt and, um, you know, make in-game adjustments to help us win games. Uh, I started playing rugby when I was eight years old. Um, I played it all the way up until my sophomore year of high school, but um, I think it was good because rugby kind of taught me, you know, not to be afraid of contact and kind of created a little bit of a competitive edge in me at a young age. Part of the reason I play football, uh, it allows me to go out there and dominate and, uh, you know, you don't have to worry about anything else. All you have to worry about is the person across from you and winning the line of scrimmage early. So it's a simple game. Once you step onto that field, all you have to focus on is football and it's, I'm gonna win and I'm gonna, you're not gonna beat me. Uh, I'm gonna win. <laughs> I threw shot put starting my sophomore year of high school. I think 
shot put did have something to do with my ability to kick step quick and with power off of uh, the snap of the ball. A lot of people describe me as a big teddy bear, you know, almost always smiling. You know, that's just how I was brought up, you know, just positive vibes all around. And my dad has been, you know, working out and training with me since I really was born and I didn't even know it. The idea is uh, not to limit his social contact, but to give him as much physical mobility as possible, whether it was in the water, on the sand, surfing, rugby, baseball, shot putting, football. I'm glad because they taught me hard work pays off and extremely hard work pays off even more. So uh, when an NFL team drafts me, they're going to get, you know, a pretty good sized human who has a tremendous work ethic, uh, my willingness to want to continue to improve and get better, and I'll be there ready to work. I'm just excited, you know.